Hey guys, welcome back to the Struggleville YouTube channel. For this video, we're going to take a look at this package that showed up at my mailbox. I actually had no idea what it was. I think I have a pretty good idea at this point, but uh, I use this mailbox for eBay returns and for companies to send me products when they want me to do a video. And judging by the name on the label right there, that's the same company that sent me that LED work light. So, after I did that video, they emailed me and said they wanted to send me another item. And what it was was an LED light bar for like a truck. And judging by the size of this, I'm thinking that's what it probably is. But they sent me the Amazon page and it was a color changing one. And it used a remote control. And I'm just not a fan of either of those. I think the color changing thing is kind of gimmicky and I don't care about that. And I, I don't like the idea of the remote because it'll quit working or you'll lose it or something and then you either lose most of the features that you paid for, at least a portion of them, or maybe the thing won't work at all without the remote. So it's one thing to get a product that you're intrigued about in some way or, and you know, you do the video and then you find out, okay, it's a piece of crap. That's one thing, but to already know ahead of time that I don't like this item or I don't expect to like this item. You know, I don't want to waste my time and I don't want to waste them sending out a product to somebody who doesn't like it before they even used it. You know, like I just feel like this is a waste of everybody's time. So I told them, no, I don't want to do a video on that. Well, a week or two later, here's the package that I'm assuming is this. So here's the thing. I don't know if I'm actually going to do a video like I would on my normal channel because I specifically told them I didn't want the item. I think what I'm going to do... My tentative plan is, since I own it now, it's here, I'm going to open it up, I'll tinker with it. If I end up liking it more than I am initially expecting to like it, then we'll uh, do a video on it maybe. But, I don't know. Well, let's open it up. That's what I'm assuming it is, just by the brand and the uh, size of it. It did get a little smaller now, didn't it? This is the dullest damn knife I've ever seen. And these mosquitoes are ridiculous. Sorry, mosquito was on the camera. So here's the remote for it. Which I don't even know how it works. Some hardware. Some more hardware. Some kind of satisfaction card and a instruction manual guy there. there she is it's got the little nuts for mounting it. it slides in that channel then once you tighten it up it locks them down so they don't move around like that it doesn't look bad it's just i'm not interested in most of the features comes with this little foot long pigtail or so i don't think i have a battery handy they're both in the cars Well, how big is this thing? Where are my tape measures at? Oh, damn it. The instructions say? No, it doesn't say how long it is. It's uh, 20 inches. So a 20 inch light bar. 
What do I do with this thing? I'll play with it eventually, but I'm not in a hurry. I'm kind of surprised they sent it after I told them I wasn't interested. Alright guys, I got work to do. I just thought I'd do this real quick video. Thanks for watching. Give the video a like, subscribe for another subscriber. And maybe you'll see this like bar on the main channel at some point. I haven't fully developed what a plan of what I want to do with it. I really wish it was just the light bar. If it was... What would be interesting, okay, real quick. If you hook this up and on, it's white, off, it's, it's just off. You know, it's just normal white LED, not like it turns red or it turns blue or yellow or some crap. And it could function completely normally without this remote, I would feel much better about it. And that might be how it works. That would be logical. I would definitely feel better about it at that point.